Welcome back to the Sea Morning Show, everyone. I hope you are staying grounded as I am right now. And of course, Ramadan is now just around the corner. And Kai, how's it going with your preparation so far, huh? What am I pre <laughs> <laughs> preparing well, for Ramadan? I, I don't know. I think getting... the most most important part about Ramadan is preparing mentally and physically. There you are. There um, you are. I'm preparing myself to be as grounded <laughs> and as exactly. calm as I can be because I feel like Ramadan comes with different sorts of challenges. Of course, and some people might find it difficult to stay healthy during Ramadan because they couldn't cope with the lifestyle shift. Oh yeah, and I can only imagine, even for those who work out every single day, the timings must change, right? How drastically. Right. So this morning, we're already dressed for the occasion. We're already grounded sitting here because we have with us today a certified fitness trainer and co-founder of Sana, Kit and Kin. Mbak Adianti Rexo Projo. It's good to have you back. She will yes. show us yes. how to do yes. do How mobility. are you guys? <laughs> so you're here to do mobility training, right? Yeah. Can you tell us what mobility training is and why it's important? All right. So, um, hi guys. Hi. hi. Okay. Mobility is like um, when you know how to, um, you know, use and utilize your joints. Mm -hmm. Our body consists of 10 joints, um, but most of them, like more of them needs to be um, have the ability to, you know, use the joints fully. Yeah. Okay. Because there's a couple of joints that we need to pay attention to, um, like shoulders, our hip flexors, you oh, know, yeah. yeah, our hip joints, our knees, joints, our ankles, and our wrists is one of those joints that needs to be paid attention to more, mm -hmm. especially, you know, in the modern society right now. You know, we tend to sit in one. Uh, one position and right. we're staying stationary. So, and our body, our ancestor, um, the body is designed to be fully used, right? We need mm -hmm. to be moved, like we need to be very dynamic. Mm -hmm. But modern, modern society, you know, switch that whole thing up. Right. Well, I just have a follow-up question, just one. What are the risks of not having our joints being able to move at its full potential? Prone to injuries, guys. Ah. Prone to well, injury. Like if I have back pain, does it mean which joints would be locked or? Well, well, most of most of us, I mean, like even I, you know, our hip flexors need to be more, you know, dynamic, uh -huh. uh, more active, and the way we seat seat it a lot, you know, we're standing a lot, you know, sometimes our psoas, the psoas is the muscles that you know, the psoas are the muscle that connects between your upper body and lower body, mm -hmm. and then they tend to be shortened. And we need to elongate those muscles, you know, those these muscles that, you know, create all the movements uh, on our daily life right. needs to be like, you know, um, lubricated. Ah. Yes, yes, <laughs> you need to be warm at all times. Yeah, yeah. Especially if you're a cyclist, you know, you're a runner, mm -hmm. you're lifting heavy like Kai yes. and <laughs> tennis. Yes. Yeah. Oh, no, all these sports needs to be, we need to be balanced when we want to fully train our body. Right. You know, you want to fully maximize our capability as a, as a human being. And we want to stay, you know, um, avoid the chances of getting injured. Yeah. While, you know, in the future run, we want to be able to move. We want to be able not to use our crooks, yeah. you know, and yeah. then, you know. No, we don't want that. You don't it's want an investment that. from now. Yeah, right, so we right. need to strengthen out and we need to be balanced when we train, when we approach our training session, you know, you know, complete the session with mobility trainings. <laughs> right, so this is, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but this is a low impact uh, Oh, this is training, low impact, right? definitely all so, low impact, but yeah, it doesn't mean... It doesn't mean that it's not going to give you benefits. Yeah. Right, of course. <laughs> now, what, uh, what sets this mobility training apart than other uh, form of exercise? Well, um, the, the difference between mobility and flexibility, mm -hmm. that there's, uh, there's yeah. two, uh, two, two similar uh, meaning, but different. Uh, when you do flexibility, you want to, you know, it's stationary, it's um, passive. And mobility is more active, active. it's more dynamic. It's so, different yeah. than, than uh, just the, uh, the traditional uh, stretching. Stretching, yes, ah, definitely. Okay. Ah. All right. Like, um, nowadays, when you approach the, you know, when you want to run or when you want to do lifting, any kind of movements, there's so-called dynamic warm-up, right? right? Yes, dynamic. so it's kind of like that. So it's kind of uh, like that, but we're specific. specifically we're focusing on opening up, you know, the joints that needs to be open. You know, I believe in motion is lotion. Yeah, yeah like that like motion, oh, is motion is lotion. Motion is lotion, guys. Remember yeah, that. so you need to move to make sure that your synovial fluid, where the joints are the ones who's creating all the hormones, all the all the lubricated that the body needs it. You need to move them. 
Ah, <laughs> okay, I can't wait to try. Great. I'm certainly in for the hip flexor opening. <laughs> yeah, I think too. that's every day's problem <laughs> with the goodness. sitting yeah. and the driving definitely, in Jakarta. Definitely. And then Ooh. being 40 plus years old. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm with you. I'm, I'm with you. Mm -hmm. like, I'm, right? Postpartum body. <laughs> postpartum body is forever. So yes, you need to true. address that. That is true. All right. All right. Let's start. Can well, we let's, start? Can yeah, we start? yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, that is true. So Here we go. I'm thinking about, you know, I'm saying that I just said that our joints, a couple of joints I need to be focused on. Mm -hmm. But beforehand, I would like to focus on our wrists. Ah. Uh, there's a lot of, you know, doing our mo mobile, okay. you know, so there's a lot of people have their, the carpal tunnel syndrome. Yeah. Ah, oh, right. Oh, yeah. So, okay, so we're going to start here, um, you know, sitting um, like this, and then just put your arms in front of you. Mm -hmm. All right. And then I want you to go into your tabletop position. And then just push forward just a little bit, a little bit more, and then go back. Inhale and exhale. Feel and them. then, yeah, and then you go forward a little bit more. Be gentle. You should listen to your body as you do this. Ranga, this is so for you. <laughs> I tell you, I feel it right away, though. Yeah, because I had a wrist injury recently. Okay, right? so take it easy, guys. Take it easy. I mean, so you should feel on your lower back, right? A little bit on your lower back, but we're focusing on our wrists right should now. I feel oh, on the wrist. Oh, okay. <laughs> It means I'm doing it right. All right, so yeah, uh, let's okay. uh, turn sideways. Oh. And then you're going to go through side to side. So this is so good for people who, you know, work a lot, like the, the guys in the oh, editing yeah. room, you know, or people doing their crunches numbers in their Excel. You know, there's a lot of going on tension on your wrist. So Pay attention, to... accountants. Yes, yes, there you go. Attention, people in the control room. <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm, I'm referring to them. Uh, <laughs> All right, now I want you to go and make your fingers facing you. So this will be a little bit um, tight. Maybe don't, um, don't, you know, don't see yourself and me as different. Mm -hmm. People have different uh, mobility issues. So respect your body. Now I want you to go back and just lean back all the way towards your heels. Oh, my right one. What's wrong with him? <laughs> the watch is too yeah. tight. And then go back. And then go back. Do you feel it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. So from here. Feel it, guys. Yeah. And then I want you to put the back of your hands. Yeah. Okay. So this will be a little bit more tense. Oh. Yeah. Just staying, staying easy. And then go back. And then stay there. Yeah, my right one is still injured. Ooh. I think. Okay, yeah. My right and then one is still so tight. Take yeah. it easy, guys. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But I can see that my right arm is it's tight. So my effective, right side. Though. Yeah. Where so. you think that? Where I think that? Uh, since I play tennis a lot, I think my right side yeah, is that's flexible yet yes, you powerful. But I can yeah. see that it's very tight. Oh, well, the tightness this, bro. can lead you into tennis elbow. Yeah, that's why I feel like it's really, really tight. There's a term of tennis elbow. It's not gonna be good when playing. You right? All right. So, that's for your wrist. That's just Ooh. a couple of wrists. Now, I want you to go forward, and then you want to make sure, we're gonna uh, work our way up. Mm -hmm. So after the wrist, we're gonna focusing on our shoulders now. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then let's go make it, make a, like a half a rainbow with your arms. And then I want you to pay attention to your palms. When you go back, try to make your palm facing upwards, and then go back towards your back. So, mm -hmm. you're opening up, and then go back. And then other side, rotate. Ooh. Oh. Wow. So you want to make it Ooh. as dynamic as possible. As My you biceps. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so okay. this is a little bit uh, focusing more on your shoulder and your rotator cuff. Rotator cuff, yes. right. How do you it's feel around it? It's good. It's amazing. I've never done this before. <laughs> and I tell you, this feels so good. <laughs> right. I tell you, this is going to feel so good too. Uh-huh. So you might pay attention to towards the side of your body that gives you a little bit um, limitation on the movements on your joints. What, how do you know that there's a limitation? Right. You should feel it, Kay. You should feel that there's one sided. It doesn't have the, that have that range of motion like the other one. So you just focus on the other one. Okay. So oh. I think I'm I'm free from shoulder problems for now. Oh, okay, that's good. So uh, 360 yeah. movement is good for you right now. Yes. Yeah. All right now. Let's go into our tabletop position. 
Yep. And then open your um, the, the palms and your arms. And now I want you to focus on your shoulder. And then just bring your shoulder towards your mat. Go there. Inhale and exhale. If you know how to do your core breathing or diaphragmatic breathing, okay, you can go ahead and use that. <laughs> Inhale and exhale. So you're focusing on that. Oh, that helps too. The breathing is always help. Yeah. Oh, I think is it good? My right wrist is hurting. <laughs> so if you want to focus on your upper body and uh, upper back, so this is Oh, uh, this is the time to yeah. do it. This also stretches your biceps, right? Yeah. Bicep, wow. lats. Bicep. The Definitely. lats. The lats. That's the one. Yeah, right, like right to us. It's good, Whoa. right? Yeah, so good. I mean, mm, not many people pay attention to this and not not many people, you know, have a big um, keen to do on yoga, right, Kay? So this is actually one really of the You don't see this in yoga ways. either. No, right? this is very specific. Exactly. <laughs> so again, It's I'm, good, right? Yeah. <laughs> I've done yoga in the past, but Never seen. Yeah, she's never, never stuck to it. Nope. Yeah. So maybe this can be your ways to right. move your joints a little bit more. Yeah. All right. How's that feeling? So good. <laughs> so good. So that's your shoulder. We're focusing on our wrist already, right. and then our shoulder. Now this How lighter already. <laughs> <laughs> now so before good. Before we head on into our hip flexors, I want uh, I want us to stand up if if mm -hmm. we could. Let's just stand up. <clears throat> So when would be an ideal time for us to do mobility training? Is, are we talking about Ramadan or just whenever? Whenever. Okay, whenever. In the morning, in the yeah, evening. Yeah, I mean, it can be done whenever you need it, as much as you need it. Uh -huh. But if you are very active, very yes. dynamic with your, with your um, fitness, uh, you might want to um, invest time. Uh, the minimum is like one week, probably like one to twice. And it doesn't take long. Yeah, it does. 20 minutes is all good. All right. So I want to make sure. Just want. I want to make sure that you both of you just you know uh, analyze yourself. Open your um, both of your feet, uh, fists, fists apart. Okay. Yeah. And then your toes are facing forward. Yeah. Now I want you to feel on your the bottom of your feet, like on the right side, on the left side. Where do you stand more? Is it on the right side or on the left side? At the moment, on the right side, because I feel a you little should bit of... feel it. For me, I stand a little bit more on the right side. Yeah, me too. Okay. Right? Okay. So let's just focus in on that. Um, I'm gonna give you a couple of movements that you can you can do it in in at home. I want you to make a fist like fist like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then put it on your temples on your yeah. Mm -hmm. And then I want you to move uh, 30 times with me. Okay. Inhale, exhale, and within in the center, and then open. That shoulder movements help this movement before we have on. Oh. Keep going. Four, five, keep going. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Twenty more. Let's go, guys. Opening up your chest. How's that feeling, Kai? Uh, like I'm balancing to the left side. Okay, so yeah. that's the whole idea. We're opening wow. up, we're opening up the fascia that it's tight you know the imbalance of the body this helps a lot in five four three two and one all right wow. oh. i feel i'm centered yeah how is that center possible? there's a couple of movements two another two movements uh -huh. i want you to open are we good yep and then rotate to the back so we're waking up our system our neural system our fascia mm -hmm our joints, our awareness on the body, just to make sure that you're balancing. Mm -hmm. ah, yeah. So no. when you so tend to, yeah, when you tend to, not. yeah, you when you tend to um, stand a little bit more to the right side or left side, this will help you out. Now, question, do you stand, uh, you should stand more on your balls of your feet or on your heels? It depends, depends. on the body, yeah. Okay, all right. All right, and then move forward and then rotate to the front. And then after that, I want you to reanalyze the body, all right? Ooh. Feeling a little bit different. sweaty. <laughs> yeah, this is a different, very good. Uh, different kind of sweats. Yeah. Three, two, and one. Now, pay attention towards your bottom of your feet. What happened? I'm centered, like More literally centered. in the middle right? of the feet. More centered. In right? the kind of fashion. So imagine if you want to start um, your lifting session uh -huh. or your tennis. Right. You want to make sure that you're centered. Exactly. So you're, you'll be, you know, you'll be safe and then you can, you know, utilize your body, the movements. 
so you are free from injuries. Yeah, yeah. Right? No, wow, I, I feel like the blood rushing into the... Yeah, face. see, it's like, like, it's like... Wow, that's... like caffeine. <laughs> like yeah, it is. Like caffeine. All right, so let's up. go down again. So you feel more centered now, right? Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll, this is what Kay's asked me for. I want to get this stuff. All right, like, you're going to get it. <laughs> you're going to get it. All right, so... Nine, I like this stretch a lot. They call it 90 90 stretch. Okay. So, where your, where your feet is 90 degree in the front. Okay. You may start maybe not 90, 90 degree on the back, but as you do this um, workout or this mobility training, you might, you know, reach that position. 90 90. So, this is the 90? This is or... the 90 and the back also 90. Oh. Okay. How is the back? Oh, going this way. Yeah. Ah. ah so, you okay. feel, oh, you, do you feel the stretch on the tension on the hip flexor? Now I do. I do. Yeah. Now right. I do. So, let's just go forward, inhale, and then exhale, push forward. Do you feel the stretch? Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh, and then good. push out. And then go to the right, uh, left side. Yeah, and then go forward. So we're focusing on this hip joints, the yeah. ball socket of your hip, right? Mm -hmm. And then go towards the, the other side. My God, this wow, side. this side <laughs> so tough. Yeah, this no, but you know what I like about this? I'm always scared of stretching my lower body because I feel I'm always stuck. But this is so dynamic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it feels like you go at it one second at a time. Right. But you feel the stretch, you're not yeah, hurting yeah, yeah. yourself. As, as I said before, right? Well, um, you know, mobility is dynamic. Uh, so, to the center, and then, oh my God, the center is tight, and then on to the right. Yeah, oh, yeah. The right. In my right side, this going this side, it's yeah. really tight. It's good, right? Tight. Wow, it's so good. Yeah? It All right. something to work on. So you know that you are, there's a limit on the range of motion on, right. the, on, the, on your hip flexors, yes. right? Yeah. So you want to be able, you want to make sure that they stay lubricated, that you want to be able to move to all towards of um, the area. Mm -hmm. All right, now, a little bit more, a little bit deeper. I want you to lift your knees up, inhale, exhale, and then two. We're lubricating the hips, hip to oh. hip joints. Three. Which is by doing this, you're doing that. Yeah. Four. So, so it's easy, it's simple, so simple, right? So imagine after sahur, let's say, after, yeah. Yeah, and then you can just Abis do this. The after subu. Uh, yeah. Roger, yeah. prayers. See? You don't or need before. much. You don't need much. You only need, on, on the sajadah juga bisa, right? If you yeah. can uh -huh. do that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, and then focusing on the back side, and then lift it up, exhale. Oh, this oh, is so good. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Two. Oh. Wow. Usually, guys, a little bit more tough on this one. It because is. They don't, they, don't re they don't really have the, um, the flexibility on their hip joints. Oh, right. I, I'm cons I consider myself stiff. Really? <laughs> on the hip joints. Four. Yeah, that's why I feel like these are extra necessary. And a five. All right, now I want you to lift, if you can, lift it up and then touch. Heel touch and then go back. Oh, I love that. <laughs> and then if you want, you can um, straighten up your arms. We want, we want to make sure we, the target of this movement, you can stay still, you can stay um, co corrected and connected during the movements, and your core is engaged, and your hip not swaying too much. Inhale, exhale, lift it up. And then go back. Ah, how's your... Love it. Oh. How's your glutes? Oh, you I feel it on your glutes as well, Absolutely right? Absolutely <laughs> love it. Does it tell you something when, let me see, I know I'm not straight. It's okay. If I'm tilting more this yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. So the body means... needs a little bit more work on that ah. side. So right. if I can Change hold it. my upper body still while doing this. That's good. I mean, I have That's good. more range of Yeah, oh, range of Because then I'm not that stiff. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> okay. So it's good, right? Now, oh, a little bit yeah. more. We're going to up the game. Oof. A little bit more challenge. You know what? As a dancer, I miss doing this. Okay. Oh, now yeah. I want you to lift your body up. Exhale. Oh man. Are you serious? <laughs> and now... Are you, Are you serious? Oof. It's good, no? It is. So good. <laughs> no, it's it's good, but it's something that I've never done before. Yeah, it's like those range of motion, maybe you never addressed it before. Yeah. yeah. And you need to be able to do that. Man, okay. Five. All right, let's switch sides, guys. Wow. Okay. Now, good. when you switch, okay, you might want to open, and then we're going to switch to the other side, all right? So we don't face back. And then oh. go back again. You feel it? Oh, man. And then go back again. Yay! 
Oh. And then go Beautiful. back again. That's good. I yeah. love this. And then go back again. Ah. <laughs> I'm stiff as a brick. <laughs> All right, let's switch. Let's do it again. Oh, yes. Ah. Let's switch. It's good, right? Ooh. Yeah, so good. Yeah. And okay. I already feel how, you know, when you're fasting, you underestimate, you know, the how important it is mm. for you to just mm. do a little to, of these exercises. Right, to yeah. stay mobile. Well, of, of the day. Yeah, yeah. yeah, there's a saying if you... Endorphins, sorry, not yeah, endorphins. <laughs> but if you stop uh, your trainings one month, it, you they said that you will lose three months of progress. Yeah. So, I yeah. That. You're right. Yes. So you need to stay, you know, training, but you know, modify it. Okay, mm -hmm. now let's go forward and then up and then go to the right side. I feel my body is not giving as much as the right side. So for me, this is a little bit more tight. So maybe you want to pay attention which part Actually, of it. I'm the other way around. Yeah? yeah. The other way around. And the right side. Because yeah. usually I was so restricted here, but now I'm, I'm much okay. So hmm. it's good, right? Everyone is different. And I think this yeah, is yeah, so yeah. great because it caters to everybody's needs. Yeah, yes. yeah, definitely. I mean, we want to make sure that our bodies stay, you, you know, avoided from injury, right? Yeah. I mean, to be honest, uh, even I have injuries, but outside of my gym practices, you know? <laughs> outside of, it's like more every day. Yeah. <laughs> because we're not, you know, alert with the form and everything. Yeah. But by doing this, you know, you make sure that your, the range of motion of your joints are fully expanded. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you're more uh, avoidable from the injuries, right? All right, so okay. what's next? We're gonna lift it up and then go down. Now, for me, this is a little bit more tight. Two, exhale, three. Are you good? Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> I'm enjoying this. How's Ranga? Is he good? I'm okay, but I know that I'm not As balanced. Yeah. Right. So you know now. Yeah. Yeah. But this is such a great opportunity to get your body, to get to know your body. Yeah, yeah, you definitely. Body, you're right. definitely. It's always more than just fitness, how balanced right? you yeah. are. <laughs> Yeah, it's very simple, but then it's going to tell you so much. Yeah, so you know. Mm -hmm. All right, now let's lift our back. Knee up. Okay, for me, this is harder than the other side. How's yours? Okay. Yours are good. Ooh. Yeah, I'm surprised. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised. Uh. Because I always feel like my hip rotators are so tight. Yeah. Uh. yeah. But it turns out I still have motion. Postpartum, I don't know. Post postpartum can, can do that to you. Yeah, okay. so it turns out I do still have some mobility, but it always hurts, like, yeah. but it's good, right? It is so good. You can do it anywhere. Yes. Without. So take notes, everybody. <laughs> take notes that In case you did miss nice. or your friends missed this episode, don't you, don't you worry because you get to see this video on demand in our YouTube channel. At yes. Yeah. All right, let's <laughs> move our, the heel touches. Inhale. Make sure that you're straightened up your legs so you don't have to slouch down. Even though if you are start, everybody starts somewhere, so it's okay. Mm -hmm. Let's go. And then push forward, knee heel touch, and then go back. Ha. Ah. Yeah, mine's a little bit tighter, this one. I don't know why. Two. How's yours, Kai? Mm. All right, I think. Very, I don't. I'm just tight. How, how, how are you, Ranga? Are you doing, doing good? it? But I'm <laughs> really. For, this are is we a lot sweating? Of we are sweating. Yes, yes. You have no idea. If it's you know how to activate kind of your core, this is good up. core exercise. Yeah, it's yeah. a different kind Imagine of sweat. Imagine doing this after your uh, Fajar prayer, right on top oh, of the mat. Oh, it's so good. <sighs> yeah. And then you take, take a shower, you know? And then you go. Yeah, yeah exactly. All right, so let's lift our, lift our body up. Ready? Yes, I'm ah, ready. Okay, ready. Let's Can go I do up. This? Exhale. Uh, a little bit more tighter on this side. It's okay. <laughs> Actually, I'm lighter on this side though. Why? Oh. Somebody's grunting. <laughs> <laughs> we men, we don't grunt. <laughs> says, says all the men in the gym. Says yes. all the men. <laughs> No grunting whatsoever. Oh. So, no, imagine if you're doing this and you have a good hip flexors when you lift weight, especially back squat. Yeah. If you're doing your back oh my squat. God. Heavy, uh -huh. you, you might not need those belts. Motion of doing it, yes. Yeah. You might not need those belts. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's belts. straighten up your legs and then feel it. How does it feel? Oh, so <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we, we've been doing loose. this for what, 10 minutes? Loose. Loose. Yeah, are you sweating? I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Got my heart rate up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, yeah. so feet together. 
Right, so what is what do you think is a tip from you to be able to manage your energy levels during fasting? Ah, that's important. Well, that's, and that's keep a good, fit by exercise. Well, that's a good question. I mean, um, well, when you're fasting, for me, um, you need to be able to have the nutri good nutrition while you're doing your sahur. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, the, the sahur in the morning. And then um, just keep moving, right? Uh, you don't want to, you know, go down on your steps. You can aim your steps still there. Mm -hmm. uh, and then during, um, for, for me, uh, before break the fast mm -hmm. is the perfect time for you to work out actually. Ah. Because okay. your stomach is empty and then the body is burning the good fat. Yeah. Yeah. Which is hard. I, I forgot about that, but that's actually good. Yeah. That's actually like, good. Well, for me, like maybe 20 minutes or 30 minutes right before Just buka. Right before buka. Uh, yeah, before right before the break fast. Yeah. And then you break the fast. Mm -hmm. For me, I used to do my... Um, coconut water with my whey protein mm -hmm. <laughs> and then just Whoa. drink it. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, I mean, it's a good carbs, yep. right? It has protein yep. and then a little bit of banana and then I go back into my work, uh, working out and then finish it out with a little bit, a little bit hit and then after that, you know, dinner. That's a, so that's a good tip. <laughs> that's a good tip. That's, that's a really good tip. tip. Yeah. So I've been, I've been doing this since 2000. 14 actually. So you start at low intensity, but still moving. Yeah. Right. And then you break the fast with a little bit of protein. And then a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little, yes. bit a little bit intense afterwards. And then a little bit intense after that. And then yeah. after that, you have you your big dinner. You feel so good after yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Wow. I'm, but I'm if you don't have the time for the, before the break the fast, um, mornings is actually okay, but you just have to modify the workout. So you the, the switch workout. it or? Well, no. for me, if it's in the morning, I will, you know, focusing more uh, on a lifting lifting session with fewer fewer reps, right? You don't want to do like full on cardio classes in the yep. morning, right? Okay. You need water. <laughs> yeah, you don't All right. Need that. Just do this. This is actually good. Are, yep. we, are we thirsty? No, right? No, We're no. not no. thirsty. This is good. This is good. Very but good. But you're moving, yeah. right? Whoa. And if you do deal with your core, right? That's actually a very good core exercise. Yeah. You don't always have to do sit ups, guys. See? Yeah, no, no, no. You don't do no, sit-ups. That's, really. that's a myth. That's a myth. That's a myth. Yeah. All right. Thank you very much, um, guys. I hope you caught a lot of the good stuff there. Mm. You know, we just doing not much. We just staying. I feel lighter. Right? Grounded. Yeah, we're now lighter. <laughs> we're breathing better, and I think I feel better because of the stretches that I've never done in the last 41 years of my yeah. life. <laughs> you, Are need, you, gonna... you need to be able to do it. Yes. <laughs> We're gonna take Thank a break you. really quickly, so guys, much. and we're gonna come back. Thank, Thank you, so you so much, much for coming for, in. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna come back, and then we're gonna be recapping some of the previous um, news on our previous segment. So stay tuned on the C Morning Show on C Today. Yes. Ooh, yes. <laughs> Thank you. Guys. So that no was need to. So good.